Medieval Life Surviving the Dark Ages Today on Echoes Through Time Channel, we will talk about the Middle Ages in Europe, and specifically we will discover the longevity of the people who lived in those days. The average life expectancy was significantly lower than it is today. Most estimates suggest that life expectancy at birth was around 30 to 40 years. However, it is important to consider several factors that influence this figure. One of the main factors was the high infant mortality rate. Many children did not survive beyond the first few years of life due to diseases and adverse conditions. If a child managed to survive the critical early years, their life expectancy increased considerably. Diseases and epidemics were another determining factor. Infectious diseases such as bubonic plague, smallpox, and influenza were common and often deadly due to the lack of medical knowledge and hygiene. The Black Death, for example, which ravaged Europe in the 14th century, killed a third of the population in just a few years, changing the course of history. Additionally, the constant presence of wars, conflicts, and violence contributed to the high mortality rate. Wars were frequent and battles, as well as raids, left a trail of death and destruction. The Hundred Years' War between England and France, for example, was a prolonged conflict that devastated vast areas and deeply affected the population. Living and working conditions were harsh for most people, especially for peasants and manual laborers. Malnutrition and poor sanitary conditions were common, which weakened health and made people more vulnerable to diseases. Cold winters, food shortages, and periodic famines added more pressure to people's daily lives. Limited access to medical care also played a crucial role. Medieval medicine was rudimentary, and many medical practices were ineffective or even harmful. The lack of medical knowledge and resources meant that many diseases and injuries were fatal. Surgery was performed without anesthesia, and infections were common, making surgical interventions risky. Religion also played an important role in daily life and attitudes toward illness and death. Many people believed that diseases were divine punishments and sought solace in faith and religious practices. Monks and nuns often acted as caregivers and healers, although their medical knowledge was limited. Despite all these challenges, it is important to note that if a person managed to survive childhood and adolescence, they could live up to 50 or 60 years, especially if they belonged to the more affluent classes who had access to better living conditions and food. Differences in the quality of life between social classes also influenced longevity. Nobles and the wealthy lived in more comfortable conditions and had access to better food and medical care. In summary, life expectancy in medieval Europe was low due to a combination of high infant mortality, diseases, wars, harsh living and working conditions, and limited access to medical care. However, those who managed to survive the early years of life had a chance to reach an older age, particularly if they enjoyed better socioeconomic conditions. The Middle Ages were a time of great challenges and changes. Despite the difficulties, 
People of that era developed the rich culture and traditions that still endure today. From Gothic architecture and illuminated manuscripts to epic literature and sacred music, the Middle Ages left a lasting legacy that continues to fascinate scholars and history enthusiasts alike. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe.